the hell are you guys doing down there, dude? Just got home from the gym, so I'm gonna shower, make a coffee, and then I'm gonna sit down and teach you guys how to make a thumbnail for your Instagram videos the easiest way. Let's get after it. Mmm. Roll the intro. All right, testing, testing, sound, check, sound, check, sound, lapel mic, new lapel mic, trying it out so I don't get any of that background noise outside and stuff. What you wanna do first um, with your Instagram video that you're about to upload, basically you wanna take a screenshot of what you want your thumbnail to be. Let's hop into our Premiere Pro project that we already have open and in our sequence, we're gonna kinda go skim through the video and see what would be a good thumbnail for it. So skimming through here, maybe, This is kind of a cool shot. It'll be kind of a cool thumbnail. So what I'm gonna do is get rid of the bars, the white bars. I can get into that in a later video if you guys wanna know how to put the white bars on there for Instagram. I prefer the white bars just because when you're scrolling through Instagram, Instagram's background is white. Instead of doing the black bars, I like the white bars. It just looks cooler. I don't know. I like that, it's my preference. I don't know. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna just go ahead and take a screenshot, export frame. We're gonna make sure this is checked, import into project, hit okay. And then at, in your project, you wanna take that still that you took and put it at the beginning. Now with Instagram, they only let you upload a minute's worth of video. So what I did is I have this all set up to be at like 59 seconds. So it'll let me upload the whole thing. And then just jump back to the beginning. What you want your, with your thumbnail, you just want it to be one frame. Super easy, just put it at the beginning of your video. You just want one frame. That's what Instagram picks it up as for a thumbnail. Once you have that all set up, and you'll have, you just hit play, and it's just a brief second you'll see it, just a brief second. So it's not gonna ruin your video or anything. That's just how you do it for if you wanna take a still with your um, video that you already have and you wanna still of that. If you have a picture, so if you took a picture during your whole video that you did, you want to put into the project. You just import it into Lightroom or Photoshop and you choose the still that you want to use. So let's say for example, this right here. Let's do this. This one right here, I kind of already have edited and I'm gonna do 16 by nine because that's what my video is and I'm gonna flip that by hitting X and I'm just gonna extend this out and choose what I want to be in frame. That looks good. Just hit enter just like that. Export JPEG 100% resize file to 180 pixels, short edge, remember short edge, and then export. And we're just gonna put that right on the desktop. So now what we wanna do is take our still that we exported, or our photo that we took, put that into your project, drag it to the beginning of your video clip and just make that one frame. So at the beginning of your clip, you just wanna scale that to frame size and you have your thumbnail. And there you have it. Just really short, so it's not really that noticeable and it makes your profile a little bit better, I guess. Um, you get to choose what your thumbnail is rather than Instagram choosing for you. So, hope you guys enjoyed that tutorial. I will catch you guys on the next video. Peace out.